We are officially headed into the banana zone. And while you may think that's a very funny name, it should actually be taken very seriously. You see, cryptocurrency moves in different cycles, including crypto winter, crypto summer, and crypto fall. And generally during some of these cycles, we see life-changing gains which make people millions, if not billions of dollars. And we are about to enter into the craziest cycle we have ever gone into historically, which means you need to be ready Ready to make a life-changing amount of money. And well, speaking of making life-changing amounts of money, I have a copy trading program which you can sign up for to automatically copy all of my trades. And here are some examples of trades that we have closed in the last couple of days which have made a lot of gains. In fact, in the last week alone, we have made more than 3,400 US dollars and you can make the exact same amount of money assuming you deposit a similar amount into your account. And signing up is very simple. If you join into our Discord, we have a join VIP section where we have a step-by-step -step instructional video where you can actually deposit money onto Fairdesk and start copy trading me right away. We have tons of people that are already benefiting immensely from this. It's your turn to also make a life-changing amount of money with our team of very experienced traders. I'll see you guys in there. The link for the Discord is down below as well as the link to start signing up on Fairdesk. Let's get rid together the banana zone is that period when you transition out of macro crypto spring into crypto macro summer the banana zone is when that happens usually after the halving there's this consolidation period down 20 percent, chopping around usual stuff and then it starts gathering 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 and then it goes crazy so let me show you a couple of charts on this so this is global liquidity this is the GMI global liquidity. This was on that tweet thread. Now, it's a very colorful chart. You probably can't read it. If you're colorblind, you're totally f But what it says is the yellow periods are summer. In summer, what we find is liquidity increases. This is global liquidity, not US liquidity, global liquidity. So in summer, liquidity starts increasing. Obviously, 2020, because of the pandemic, it went bananas. But 2016, 2012, these were good periods for liquidity. And guess what? Crypto technology, they all rose. Then you get into fall. Fall is often when the real fireworks happen. Liquidity keeps pumping and then eventually tops out into winter. That's when you get the corrections, the crypto down cycles. So we've got the best two parts of the cycle to come. Obviously, the best entry was at the bottom of winter. That's when I was buying um, Solana, Ethereum, um, all back then. And then I've obviously switched around. So I'm pretty much 100% Solana right now outside of small meme stuff and other bits and pieces because Solana, the Solana Bitcoin cross chart, Solana ETH cross chart looks so compelling that I'm like, if my job here is to make as much money as possible, I'm just going to own the thing that I think is going to go up the most. So that was the view I had. You will have a different way, but please don't get stuck into a narrative. You're still stuck in some token from three cycles ago because somebody's telling you that it's it's going to definitely be the next big thing. It's not big thing after three cycles, two cycles. It's not going to be the big thing. So just try and make money. I'm trying to allow you not to f this up. Don't f this up is the key mantra. When you've got a liquidity cycle ahead of you like this, please take advantage of it. So yellow tends to be in the summer, tends to be decent, but you get, there's been two cycles where fall was bananas total bananas and then you had the last fall in 2021 which was less so it's because the liquidity came earlier in 2020 so we don't know how it's going to play out but this is how it should play out here's a chart from exponential age asset management which is my fund of hedge funds so it's an asset management firm that invests in the world's best hedge funds to capture this trend of going from two and a half billion dollars where the market cap is now to 10 trillion we're at 10 to 15 trillion where it is this cycle, and then to 100 trillion where I think it goes by, let's say 2032, 2034, something like that. This is going to be the biggest, largest, fastest accumulation of wealth in all human history. And that's why I keep saying don't f this up. That's why I have a long term time horizon. That's why I don't trade around this. Just let it do its job. So here's when we talk about doing its job. So we look at the, the, the bottom, the highest return section and the lowest return section. So out of the three years, 
crypto spring, macro spring, summer and fall. Crypto is the best performing asset in the world. In the next year, in fall, it's the worst performing asset. Okay, so that's what you get. But when you look at the accumulative returns, NASDAQ since 2011 has done 769%. That's amazing. 17% a year. Well, Bitcoin's done 20 million percent at 139% annualized. Ethereum, 324% at 146% annualized. And Solana, which is a shorter history, 8,300% at 203% annualized. Wow, this is truly a pivotal moment in all of our financial journey. I mean, in the next 10 years, if the crypto markets hit a $100 trillion market cap, like many people like Raul Pal are predicting, that means that we all have the ability to make multiple millions of dollars easily. It's just a matter of making the right choices. Now, Raul Pal may think that Solana is the premier choice right here, but I very strongly believe that other options are far superior, mainly including XRP and HBAR. And the reason for that is they are technologically superior to Solana and they are also ISO compliant, meaning they can actually work with financial institutions, banks, hedge funds, you name it, in order to one, tokenize all real world assets, two, work on making central bank digital currencies, and three, also do cross border payments. These are all things that Solana actually can't do. And for that reason, XRP and HBAR have a ton more. More intrinsic value than the likes of Solana. Now, this isn't to say that Solana won't have a great run, and this is not to say that other cryptocurrencies also won't have life-changing amounts of gains. It's just important that at this moment, we put the majority of our portfolio on the plays that are most likely to absolutely explode in price. With that in mind, I want to know which cryptocurrency you guys think will have the most explosive potential during the next bull run peak. Let me know in the comments down down below. So what exactly is the banana zone and when does it start? Well, Ryle Pal is going to talk about this so we can all time our holdings perfectly. Listen up. This is the banana zone. Why it's called the banana zone is because the chart A looks like a banana and B, everything goes bananas. And that comes after the halving, after this consolidation, it does this. Will it be identical? Will Is 300 grand the price target? Whatever. I don't know. But it will go bananas unless something dramatic changes. I do an enormous amount of work. There's literally thousands of pages of research from Julian Bittle and myself on this. So this is not just some flippant comments. We'd see liquidity rising going forwards. There's there's sources of liquidity everywhere from the Fed cutting rate and the Treasury draining the, the general account to the Fed cutting QT to um to potentially um the Treasury offering some liquidity provisions to China so they can manage the debt deflation. They're starved of dollars. Something with Japan who also needs dollars because there's this um you know their currency has been collapsing. There is a lot of opportunities. The Europeans are going to cut rates, the UK are going to cut rates. There's a lot of opportunity for liquidity. The Fed may let's say spin up a special purpose vehicle to get rid of commercial real estate from the banks. Who knows? But the cowbell is coming. Listen out for it. It's already started. So the banana zone is all cowbell and markets going parabolic. So hopefully that gives you some understanding of what I think lies ahead. Will it be perfect? No. Does it chop around here for another month or two? Could do. Does it finish? If I look at the previous um, cycles, they two of them uh, ended in the third week of May, the consolidation, and then went. And the other one was July. 2020, but 2020 was weird because we had the pandemic in the middle. It was kind of a screwy cycle. So I don't know. It's close. They all look like they're making perfect wedge patterns. All of that. Everything else seems good. What's also great about macro spring, uh, sorry, yeah, macro summer and fall is that you can basically take any asset. It's going to go up. So all commodities, those of you who love commodities, copper's done well. It'll go up. Gold will go up. Oil eventually will do. Um, doesn't feel great right now. Oil stocks will, mining stocks will, um, all cyclical plays will. Tech stocks, semiconductors, they all do phenomenally well. Crypto does it. So you can be the moron, which is a nice way to be in markets. Nobody wants to try and overthink stuff. And you, pretty much anything you buy will go up. 
but some things have got more than others. That's the, that's how I look at the world. Everything's everything correlated. Everything, the everything code cycle of the four year debt refi cycle means that everything gets correlated. A few assets lead crypto and tech. Others follow the business cycle. The business cycle's bottoming, so they all bottom. But they're all correlated. Everything's correlated. So for me, I like to keep everything really moronically simple. If everything's correlated, then there is no such thing as diversification. It is really important to me when I set up this whole thing for Real Vision to guide people through this massive transition, this transition into a new system where the old system is broken. We're forced to speculate. The system is rigged against us. Asset prices keep going up. Wages don't go up. Everybody's polarized. Everybody hates each other. You throw in immigration, global trade, you throw in aging populations, you throw in AI, robotics, right? This is not easy for anybody. Everybody just feels like it's out of their control. And I get it, but you've been given the gift. Crypto is the gift. And all you have to do is not fuck this up. All you have to do is not fuck this up. I mean, he couldn't have said it much better. We've seen these cycles happen time and time again. How many times are we going to watch these cycles happen right before us and sell the bottom and buy the top before we finally learn our lesson? Okay, this is our opportunity. It's coming. It's right around the corner. Quantitative tightening is going down. The interest rates are falling. Banks are approving a pro-crypto legislation. Banks are getting crypto to be part of the services that they offer. All of this is happening right before our very eyes. We are witnessing the largest financial revolution of our entire lifetime. It's our opportunity to make life-changing amounts of money, and we cannot mess this up. So if you want to benefit the maximum amount possible from this, make sure that you do sign up to my copy trading program. I have an entire team of traders that are already making a ton of people a life-changing amount of money. I want you to be one of those people as well. Make sure that you sign up. Use the Fairdesk link down below. Join our Discord community for these step-by-step -step instructions like i told you guys earlier we are going to do this together i want to build an amazing community of people that have made a life-changing amount of money together that is what we're doing on the levi crypto channel you can join in or you could be left behind that is frankly your choice either way it's okay with me because we're already changing a ton of people's lives and we're only going to continue to do that especially as we head into this insane bull cycle that's coming up here so ladies and gentlemen get your bags ready things are about to get absolutely insane hit the like button and subscribe if you enjoyed today's content and i'll see you guys in my discord peace out